Hi, this is Dr. Khalsa, and this is part two of my series about your glandular system. If you missed the earlier videos, you can find them on my website or on my YouTube channel. In this video, I will be discussing how your adrenal glands are the most important organ in your body at helping you adapt to stress. Please see the list that comes with this video of my suggestions of things that you can do right now to increase your ability to handle stress. You have two adrenal glands and they're very small organs that sit on top of your two kidneys. This gland secretes hormones into your blood that affect every cell in your body. The principal hormones are adrenaline, which stimulates your fight or flight metabolism, cortisol, which regulates your energy metabolism, corticosterone, which reduces inflammation, and aldosterone, which controls blood pressure. You don't have to remember these names. I had to look them up myself. But the overall effect of all these hormones is to help your body adapt to stress. When your adrenal glands are strong, your ability to adapt to stress is much greater. Imagine that your body is like a car going down a bumpy road. This is the road of life. And as we all know, it has bumps large and small. If your adrenals are in good shape, then it's like having really good shocks and tires. You're aware of the bumps on the road, but you still have a smooth ride. If your adrenals are exhausted, then it's like having worn out shocks and tires. Every bump, even the little ones, are a shock to your system. How do your adrenals get exhausted? When you're not taking care of yourself, the adrenal glands are the first organ to start to get exhausted. Your adrenals bear the brunt of the attack by trying to adapt to the less than optimal conditions of your life. Sugar, alcohol, caffeine, lack of sleep, lack of exercise, excessive drive to succeed, trying to please everyone, making poor choices, etc. And remember, the rocks in your backpack from the previous video? All these layers of past unresolved stress are also constantly challenging your adrenals. The good news is that with a change of lifestyle, your adrenals will eventually recover and act as a buffer so that you can deal with the bumps in the road without freaking out all the time. Please refer to the list of suggestions that I mentioned earlier in the video. In my next video, I will cover many of the reasons behind fatigue. If you have any questions about this topic or any other health challenge, give me a call at 626-345-9750. If you'd like to get future videos, click the like button if you're on Facebook, or subscribe to my channel if you're on YouTube, or enter your email address if you're on my website. Until next time, this is Dr. Sinto Khalsa, and my prayer is that you and your family stay healthy and strong.